Do you have some low quality photos that are taken from back in the day and you want to upscale them and want them to look good, but you don't know how? There is a free tool that you can use to upscale any image and make them look very nice and crisp using AI. Let me show you in today's video how you can actually achieve that. The tool we're going to be using today is called Nightmare AI Real Estergan. I probably said that wrong. You can use their website. It will be linked down in the description below. All you have to do is upload the image right there and it will automatically upscale it using AI. No registration, no paying, no nothing, completely for free. Let's go and let me show you how to do that. All right, so now that we are on the website right here, you can see the demo they're using and how it looks like. You have this like low quality image of the of the cat and then you can see how much bigger the upscaled version is and how much better it looks like. We're going to use some demo photos that I downloaded randomly off the internet and I'll try to upscale them and see how they look like so you can use this tool yourself. Let's go. So as you can see, I chose this random photo that I found online it's just a road and you can see the field in the background it's pretty small it's 639 by 425 very small photo 72 dpi and all i'm gonna do is click here to upload it use the eight scale uh the you know the upscale no face and hands because there is no face and we click submit and we wait just a little bit it literally takes like 30 seconds or so we wait it out and you will see how much bigger the upgraded image is going to be and boom it's already done actually and look at this stuff right here. You can see that the image looks way better. It's much bigger. And if I click download, I can quickly download it and see how much bigger it is. That is some huge change right there, completely for free. So another example image that we have over here is this small image, 320 by 200. So very, very small, as you can see in the small window right there. We're going to be using a scale that is a bit smaller, so we don't want to upscale it too much and look, you know, weird. We're going to use scale four and I'm going to click submit. So let's see what it makes off of this, you know, just random Shutterstock photo. As you can see, the photo is much larger, but it does add this like colorful and this uh, uh, effect of like a cartoon, right? It makes it too cartoony because it's upscaling a lot of these things and it needs to fill in the gaps that are missing in the missing pixels. So that's one of the problems that you might be noticing when you use this upscale AI, uh, you know, software and these tools is that they do make some of the photos a little bit cartoony, right? Uh, what you, how you can fix that is you can use a lower scale. So if you use a lower scale, it won't upscale that much. So it won't use that much of this, uh, you know, cartoon effect. It will sometimes be noticeable. So keep an eye on that. You can use it for some photos, for some you cannot, especially with the face. Uh, you know, if you have a photo of yourself that is low resolution, you can enable face and hands as well, and then it will make the face much brighter, much better looking as well. That's how you can make a lot of images look better using a simple and free AI tool. I know it's a quick video, but I hope I helped some of you out. If you got this far into it, make sure to drop a like. And if you haven't already seen my AI videos, especially this chat GPT one, make sure to check it out right here. If you don't already know, I do stream on Twitch three days a week. Link is down in the description below. Anyway, I'll see you in the next video. Peace out and have a good one. Bye bye.